Santos Calderón. Colombia's president signs a peace treaty with the leader of the Marxist FARC rebels, ending more than a half century of war. After the signing, President Juan Manuel Santos sent the deal straight to Congress for a vote next week. The government's majority means approval is likely to be speedy. But the revised peace accord is the second such effort and comes after an initial deal was rejected last month by millions of people. Despite widespread relief at the end of the conflict, many among Colombia's largely conservative residents are angry because, like the original agreement, the New Deal will not jail FARC leaders who committed kidnappings, and it allows them to hold public office. Former President Alvaro Uribe spearheaded the push to reject the original accord, and he wanted deeper changes to the new version. As Colombia's gathered in the capital, Bogota, they did so with mixed emotions. It's a mix of emotions, happiness, hope, I'm here not only as a citizen, but as a human rights activist. I think Colombia was searching hard for this moment. The FARC began as a rebellion fighting rural poverty. It has battled a dozen governments, as well as right-wing paramilitary groups. The signing ceremony marked a six-month countdown for the FARC to abandon weapons and form a political party.